Welcome to today's video. This one is a little bit more zoomed in than usual. I am still playing around with my filming setup. Um, luckily enough, as we speak, I do have my brother and my partner um, upstairs assembling a desk for me that I picked up for $30 from Kmart, so I thought, why the heck not? Um, I am hoping to set up one of our spare rooms as an office very, very soon because my planner collection is taking over our entire lounge room. So, what I'm gonna do, it's been a little while since I've posted a video, so today I am working on bringing to you guys a haul. Um, as you can see, or maybe not see, because it has zoomed in, it is, I have a lot to get through today, so I'm gonna try and get through it as quickly as I can. I did contemplate doing two separate videos, but because some of the stickers um, are from orders like before Christmas, I thought I would just do it all in one haul, get it all over and done with, catch you guys up on where I am, um, and then that way we can just move on into the new year, I can get into my planning, and we can continue. Um, I have been holding on to a lot of this because originally, like most things, um, a lot of my orders came, well, some of my orders came before Christmas, um, but a lot of them have just started arriving now. Um, so I didn't want to film a video with like three things um, kind of seemed pointless. So now everything's sort of rolled in. I don't think I have anything outstanding in terms of order deliveries now. So, um, and the hardest thing is, is that in wanting to plan, I actually want to use some of these stickers, but because I've been sitting on them for so long, I thought I better do the haul. That way I can use my stickers. I don't have to worry. Um, and all of my incoming orders will be up to date. So then, you know, whenever I get more orders, I can do another haul and, you know, we're sort of up to speed. Um, so without further ado, I'm gonna get into it. Um, I'm gonna try and keep things in order. I can't really remember if they're in order or not, um, but I'm gonna start with some of the orders that I ordered before Christmas. Um, they obviously came in a little bit later because I did order them late. I did have Christmas kits lined up, so these will probably go towards next year's stash, um, and I'll just hoard them uh, until next year. Um, and I mean, some of these stickers shops are international, so um, that's why it's taken them a little bit longer to come in. Um, so I'm just gonna move that, uh, these out of the way and we'll get into it. So the first haul that I have is from, uh, I don't know if I'm pronouncing this right and I apologize if I'm not, but it is from Mira Mabel or Mira Mabel. Um, I believe, without looking at my computer, I believe they're a German based store and I think they're actually participating in a European planner sale either at the moment or over the coming days. So I will link them in the comments below if you want to check them out. Their store is absolutely amazing. Um, okay, so the first thing that I got as part of my order was this little, wow, this is how long it's been. So this is actually a Black Friday freebie. Um, so just a cute little fashion girl, a little buy gift sticker, coffee break, shopping time, sale, time to plan and some little page flags. Um, I then also got, as I said, some of these are Christmas kits. Um, actually, maybe it's only one of these that's a Christmas kit. No, okay, I've got two Christmas kits in amongst this pile somewhere. Um, so as soon as I saw this kit, I was in love. I was a very basic planner last year, um, so I thought that I would kind of level it up this year. So I'm aiming a lot more towards foils. Um, if I do find kits that don't have foiling in them, I'm looking to use overlays and that sort of thing to, to brighten it up and make it a little bit more fun. Um, but this is the kit that I got um, for Christmas. Um, as I said, this will go towards next Christmas is um, plans, but um, it's called Jolly. So these are the full boxes here. Um, so the little quote box says, "'Tis the season to be jolly." And it's in a foiled silver. I'm hoping that that's catching. And you can see, I'm not sure if you can see it on the camera here, but it's also got some red foiling as well. It's absolutely beautiful. And I had to have it. Like as soon as I saw it, I had to have it. Even though it's more towards like an American white Christmas, doesn't matter. I wanted it. Um, so these full boxes, they're absolutely stunning. Like with the silver and the red foil, how could you not want this kit? Um, I don't know if it's still in her store, but again, if you're wanting to check it out, you're wanting to see if you might be able to get a hold of it for next year and hoard it yourself, um, like I said, I'll drop the link in the comments below. Um, so then you've got your more functional items. So you've got your heart checklists, you've got your page flags, you've got your todays, your to-dos, you've got some little like spare 
um, strips here that you could, I guess, use for like headers or you could use them to like fill in white space. Um, got some appointment labels, some quarter boxes, your Hello Weekend banner again in that gorgeous silver foil. You've also got your, oh my goodness, I didn't actually look at this kit all the way through. Wow. So the bottom washi, white with that gorgeous red foil. It is stunning. I, I, can I use this kit now? Like, can I just pre-plan Christmas next year? Um, okay, so again, we've got our bottom washi here. You've got some washi strips again to fill in space or you can use them to overlay like whatever you might want to. You've got some half boxes. You've then here got your date covers, your like weekly habits tracker or appointments tracker or whatever you might want to do. Um, you've got another spare box here. You've got some actual habit trackers, some more page flags, some more little like appointment labels and quarter boxes. And then you've also got the thin washi strips as well. So if you wanted to use both of your washi strips, you can do that. If you didn't want to use both of your washi strips, you can choose to either or. Um, or you can save it. So I've got a little secret coming up shortly, but I'm not gonna tell you guys in this video. You'll have to keep watching and I will fill you in on it. But if I don't use both of these washi strips, I'll be able to use it towards those. So super excited about that. Um, and again, got that silver foiling detail. You've then got, oh, this is your, Wow, okay, this is different. So this is your um, like little things. So you've got your little things headers and then you've got obviously like your meals, your TV shows, camera, I guess you could use that for like filming or taking photos. You've got cleaning, happy mail, you've got like some random pet ones, little hearts, like what looks like like a medical briefcase, a little running girl, um, some bill juice. They're super cute, I've never seen anything like that. I love that. Um, and then you've got a whole heap of heart checklists. And I actually love this because I'm trying to move myself away from no white space planning a little bit. I do like the planning, having more stickers as opposed to none. I just feel like when I try to white space plan, it looks absolutely ridiculous. So I've steered clear from it. Um, so I'm still incorporating heart checklists, you know, on days where I have more things to do. Um, but aside from like your four boxes, you've also got these cute little like three ones. So I feel like I'm probably gonna be able to use those, all of those. Um, but again, that beautiful silver foiling detail. Um, so that is the first kit from Mira Mabel. Now, because I've basically run you through the layout of her kit. I'm not gonna to spend too much time sort of concentrating on the layout and you know what's incorporated. Um, but I'm just gonna sort of skim through because like I said, I do have a fair few things to get through that I wanna share with you guys. Um, so this was the second kit that I purchased from Mira Mabel. And again, you can see that gold foil is stunning. Like the minute I saw this kit, I had to have it. And again, the only reason that I can show you this kit is because I haven't actually planned in my brand new planner for 2019. So my last planner ended beginning of January um, as it would normally. So it finishes off December into January, but then my next planner is from January to December, 2019. So I haven't done that spread yet. So I'm showing you this so I can actually go in and do that. But this is absolutely stunning. Um, so again, like your functional items, um, obviously in the same color scheme with your uh, foiled weekend banner. This kit's called New Year. Again, I don't know if it's still in her shop, if you can get it, but by all means, check her out. The The kit is stunning. Like, look at the detail in the washi. Like, look at the fireworks. And like, even in the like, more decorative type strips, the confetti foil, the, uh, like, it, like, I honestly, I'm obsessed. And if this is gonna be the first kit in my 2019 planner, I've, I've set the standard for the year pretty high. I don't know how I'm gonna compete with this but it's absolutely beautiful. And I'm a very, like pink's my favorite color. So this kit was perfect for me. Um, again, you've got obviously your date covers, your thin washi strips, your um, week banners. Um, again, all that gold foiling detail. Your little things and bill juice. Again, sticking to that pink and black color scheme. And then you've got your functional boxes again. And this one, of course, has the gold foiling detail. 
The third and final kit, and again, this is another thing that I want to incorporate back in 2019. I started to do it, I think it was 2016, maybe 2017, very briefly, and I didn't stick to it because I had a bad habit of ordering stickers too late. So I would leave it to the last minute to order stickers, and then by the time that they came in, the month was over and it was pointless. So I'm gonna start using monthly kits. I'm unsure whether I'm sold on the monthly notes pages yet. So please, if you do use monthly notes pages, please drop me a link to like your YouTube or your um, Instagram below because I do wanna use them. I feel like it's a, a practical way of sort of snapshotting your month ahead of time and sort of planning it out. Um, but I don't know how to use it. So I would love to see ideas. Um, but anyway, this is the kit that I picked up for January. Again, it hasn't gone into my new planner yet because first of all, I only just got it like just after Christmas. Um, and I wanted to show you guys these stickers before I laid them down. So this one is a beautiful, beautiful hollow foil. And I don't know why, but I have a feeling I am like, I, I think hollow is my, um, favorite foil. I think I've decided on hollow as my favorite foil. So guys, if you're watching and you are a sticker maker and you stock hollow foil stickers, please drop your links below. Let me check you out. I am obsessed with holographic foil. Um, I've not found many places that do hollow gold foil. So again, bonus points if you have hollow gold foil available in your shop. Um, so this is a bit more straightforward than your regular weekly kit. So you've just got um, obviously the, the header with the dates, um, some little deco here, um, a strip here to fill in those, uh, the dates of the month that don't have any dates essentially. So at the beginning of the month, you'll probably have like the end of December here. We only really want it from the first. So that there obviously adds on to this, fills in that space at the top. Um, absolutely beautiful. You've then got your more functional items. So you've got some washi strips here again to either like frame your month, to use to track, you know, traveling or holidays or anything really. Um, you've got some functional items. So you've got like haircuts, nail appointments, telephone, birthdays, car, what looks like perhaps trains. Um, you've got some blank ones that you can obviously icon yourself and use for whatever you would like. Some little mini page flags, some payday stickers and some quarter boxes. So very practical there. You can basically plan out the month however you want using these. Um, you've then got another little strip here that you can use to block out some dates. So I'm assuming this will probably go somewhere towards the end of the month. I haven't actually looked at my January planner yet. Um, so either at the end of the month or if there's another section in the month that you just want to block out altogether, that will cover off two boxes. Um, you've then got some hollow foil, um, like day off, vacation, important stickers, some more little deco, some cute little arrows. I don't know what I'll use them for, but I'm sure I'll find a use for them. Um, you've got some checklists so again this would be more so for those people that again want to track like goals and birthdays whatever it is that you track for the month this is to do that down the sidebar on the right hand side of your Erin Condren and then of course you've got your date dots or in this case date flags again in that beautiful hollow foil this is a really large monthly kit. This is amazing. The last time I used a monthly kit, I felt like there wasn't enough to plan out my month. I'm pretty sure it was Monique Plans. You had mentioned a similar thing where you weren't able to find something that was practical enough or large enough to complete a whole monthly spread. Girl, I got you. Um, and then you've got like just some fun things. So again, whether you wanted to incorporate this into a spread somewhere else or whether you wanna mark it on your calendar, go ahead. You've got some bills. Um, what looks like like some credit cards for credit cards that you might be tracking. You've got some movie banners. You've got like pizza night change sheets. A little car with some luggage on top. So if you're going on holiday, again, you could like layer that over a washi strip and mark your holiday. You've got date night, girls night, party time, garbage day, some page flags and just some other little decorative flags. You've even got like little memos here like to call, to clean, to go, to do. So you could either layer them up and put them on here, like add them in here, or you could 
jot them down in, in your actual spread. But that's the monthly spread for January, and that is actually my last kit from Miramabel. Like I said, I will leave the, the uh, shop link below. Her kits are absolutely stunning, as you've just seen. Straight on to the next store. So, I have opened the envelope, guys, but I have not opened the plastic inside. So let's go through it together. This is my very, very first order from the one and only Arctic Paper Studio. That envelope kind of blends into my background, but it's a, just a cute little black envelope. It's got a gorgeous little like fashion girl on a scooter or a moped, um, and it's got my name on it. Stunning. And then it's sealed with a cute little heart sticker. I'm just gonna pop that open and pull out the goodies. All right. So, got a couple of things here. So I got a bunch of foil things. Don't remember exactly what I got. Again, this was like a. I don't know if I, th I don't know if it was before Christmas or just after Christmas, but again, December order. So I'm gonna start with. I might start with the little ones first. So let's open. So this just says foiled goodies. So again, I mean you can see it here. This is a. Um, little pack with foiled goodies in it and it's got a cute little sticker here again I don't know if I'm gonna be able to open it oh yeah okay I don't want to rip it it's so pretty so much effort has gone into wrapping these it's stunning and again just some cute little like Christmas fairy lights okay so let's get into this what did we get Okay, so we've got a cute little orange doily, absolutely gorgeous. Just a cute little detail. So, these are all little foiled stickers. Like I said to you guys, I want to move more towards the foil range this year. And I had no functional items, no nothing. So, I thought I'd stock up. And what better way than when Arctic Paper Studio has a special. Um, so, we've got some cute little Friday stickers. I think a lot of these will be double ups because I think I did get a lot of like the, the multiple medals. So I'll just kind of skip through them if so. So you've got the, goodness, I can't do two things at once apparently. Um, you've got the gorgeous gold Frye foil. Silver Frye. So like I said, I'm just gonna kind of gonna skim through them. But as you can see, I've got the mixed medals. Just a plain black and white Frye. I've then got the nail appointment stickers again in the multiple I've also got a few in the just the plain like a black gloss just in case I do pull away from a foiled kit or in case I have a foiled kit that's overly foiled and I don't want to put more foil onto it so I've just got something that's a bit more neutral some silver foils I've then got my favorites the buy stickers uh, fill up fuel so again, I think I got these in multiples. Yep, so I got them in the black and white as well. And I got them in the silver. Then I got the gorgeous day off stickers. Again, in the gold foil, the silver foil, and the more neutral black and white. Then you just have this cute little card. Now, again, I may keep what Before, I used to actually sell off my journaling cards and random bits and pieces. I think I might keep these now for my new project. But again, not giving you guys any details just yet. You'll have to wait and see. But cute little freebie there. All right, so that was the first stack of foiled goodies. Let's see what the second stack has. Again, a cute little card at the back here. Oh, it's so cute. Like, businesses don't have to go to these extremes. Like, guys, we buy your stickers because we want your stickers. Like, the fact that you guys go to this effort, it's... I love it. It's, I really appreciate it. Like it's, it shows that you take like time and effort for your clients. You're not all about that sort of money thing. You know, there's a lot of businesses out there that are just money hungry and they don't really care about the small guys. So it's really nice to see businesses that do. So again, you've just got your little orange doily. I'll show you this card at the beginning. Oh, it's a recipe card. That's cute. Oh, so just another little cute Christmas themed card. All right, so again, a little bit behind. I do wanna go back and mark them on my previous spreads, but I may also hoard them until this year. But if not, I'll buy more. So we've got a Christmas countdown. 
and again mixed metals are going on here so I've got it in the gold I got it in the silver I then got the coffee Monday but first coffee stickers because again coffee coffee is life am I right thumbs up coffee is life um, again mixed metals so I got them in the silver as well and I also got them in the black and white Again, something that I can either rewind and go back to previous spreads to use these for, or I can keep them for this year. So it's just your public holiday. So you've got like Good Friday, Christmas Eve, Boxing Day, Christmas Day, Easter Monday, New Year's Day, New Year's Eve. Again, with the mixed metals. So this one I got in a rose gold, and I also got it in a silver, as well as a black and white. Um, waxing appointment. I live at the waxing salon. At least it feels like that. I'm there every three weeks. It kills my life. But here we are. Thought I'd make it pretty, at least in my planner. So got that in the gold. Got that in the silver. Got that in the black and the white. And then I got these. So all of the ones I've just shown you have all been like white backgrounds. And these are your clear overlays. So this one is... I don't remember what it's called but it's just oh it's for like weddings that's right because i for anyone who's been watching me for a while or spoken to me recently i am yet to plan out my wedding week last year or my honeymoon because i have been trying to source the perfect kits for the wedding week and for the honeymoon like i want the kits to be like perfect so at some stage or another throughout this year, I'm gonna do a rewind plan for each of those weeks of our honeymoon and our wedding and like my bridal shower and those sorts of things. Uh, but I wanted, wanted them to be perfect and I wanted to bring in foils and I just, I still haven't found the perfect wedding kit, but I've just not been able to find the wedding kits or, you know, honeymoon kits that I like. So I thought I'd pick these up so that I can, again, I can add them in when I go back. Um, so it's just basically like create a theme, book your venue, your cake appointment, your guest list, some celebration balloons, wish list, you've got an order the cake sticker, plan the music, save the date, invite sent out, gifts, plan a menu. And I got those in both the silver and the gold, just in case, but I thought they were super cute. Um, so that was that little pile done. Then I've got one more little pile here and I think these are just overlays. So I think, I don't know whether I, I don't think I got bottom overlays. I think they are purely um, like full box overlays. But again, moving into that foil life, guys. Oh God, I just ripped that sticker. Makes me sad. Okay, so this is the last little portion of this order. So again with the doily, some of the little white doily. Now what have we got here? So we've got what looks like some little like freebies. So we've got, oh, that's cute. That is so cute. So Jazz has actually put like a little mini Christmas card in here. It's gorgeous. And it just says, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Wishing you a year full of happiness and planners. Jazz, Jazz, my girl. 2019. I'm all about that planning life. Um, and then we've got some little freebies here. So we've got like a little die cut. Again, totally can use this. A life lived is a life loved. So this looks like it's like a little geode or something. It's like foiled and it's very cute. Uh, and then you've got a little like can be a gift card or you can use it for like whatever you might like and it says without a care in the world I'm pretty sure I want that to be my motto for this year like I've this year after last year like I'm not going to go into it to, in too much detail but my friends could tell you that I had the most up and down roller coaster of a year last year though I do feel like a lot of people I've spoken to had a very roller coaster 2018 so guys without a care in the world 2019 we got this we then got a premium matte freebie, December. Just some cute little icons, a little fashion girl uh, three quarter box, I'm gonna say. An appointment label and some little mini checklists. She's so cute. They look like, oh, so yeah, so premium matte, okay. 
Uh, your order is here. Thank you. Hooray for new foiled stickers. I hope you love your new releases. Don't forget to follow us on Instagram at Arctic Paper Studio to share your exciting haul. And then it's just got their little website address as well. And then last but not least, I'm not going to use that. I'm not going to show anyone that, but there is a little code here for a VIP purchase and just a cute little card. Um, now into the remainder of the order. So again, like I said, probably gonna have some mixed metals and bits and pieces here, but I've picked up some overlays. So I've got a gold full box overlay and that's just in like a standard line. I picked up the silver. Oh God, I'm so bad at this still. I've still gotta get used to this. So I've got the silver in the same. My first time purchasing page flags with confetti or foil on them. So again, I think I got mixed metal. Yep, yeah. okay. so. We've got the gold, and this is in the, nope, I don't know. It's in a like a pastel color scheme. I'm not sure what it's called, but you'll find them on her website. It's just got like a, a gray, a pale pink, a like tealy, bluey, pastel blue color, like a lilac, and then like a more lavender type color. And I got that in the gold, and I got that in the silver as well. I then got, this is like my favorite color scheme. And again, I'm thinking I might be able to use this when I rewind spread my wedding plans and things like that. So again, I've got them in the mixed metal. I just got the silver and the gold, but they've got like a gray. They've got like a dusty pink or a dusty rose color. There's like a deep magenta kind of plummy type color. And then like a more of a mauve maroon burgundy type color. So got those in both metals. And then again with the overlays. So again, can use them for last year, can hoard them for this year. So this is just in the gold and it's got Merry Christmas and then just some little decorated baubles, another little bauble and a little um, poinsettia. I'm gonna be so bold as to say that's a poinsettia, flower poinsettia, however you say it. I've then picked up some more full box overlays. So you've got like a confetti type, um, so they're four different confetti type layouts and that's just in the gold foil. Then gotten some to use for Valentine's Day. So they've got like little love hearts in them. Some more confetti type, little stars here. These are all in gold. Um, and then again, just some gold like confetti. You've got like a double, double box and some little bows. Not so these I didn't order, these are freebies. So this says shine like a star. Really, really cute. You've got some cute little boxes and like icon stickers and some little hearts. And then we've got some yes, yay, wow, smile, and smile stickers. And then again, we've just got like a cute little card here. I'll put all that back together. So that's my order from Arctic Paper Studio. Guys, don't judge. It's a lot. Like I said, I've been, <laughs> I've been waiting on them for a little while. Um, when I was getting ready to film this video this morning, um, I came over like to my coffee table because I wanted to make sure I had everything with me that I wanted to haul like in the video today. <laughs> And I came over and I had like all of these parcels in my hand. I don't know how many there are. And hubby looked at me and he just stared at me. And all I could think of was Marshmallow Studio, the little stickers of um, Debbie Downer. I'm not sure what the, the guy partner's name is. And they're just standing there. And it's like her trying to hide stickers. Like she looks nervous. She's got like a, a parcel there. Um, but hubby looked at me and he's like, are you right? Um, <laughs> You guys don't know my hubby. Basically, are you right means like, have you got enough there? Have you spent enough money? So I think I'm now gonna have to become that wife that hides some of her purchases from her husband because whilst he knows that I purchase stickers, he doesn't usually see how much I spend on stickers or how much I actually order because they usually come in in drips and drops. So he was a little bit shocked. Um, leading on from Debbie Downer conversations, my next order is from Marshmallow Studio. Now this is a very recent order. When I saw it advertised on Instagram, 
I had to have it. It is stunning. So I just got some washi tapes. Now I'm not gonna open them just yet because like I said, I'm setting up upstairs and I wanna keep everything sort of intact until I um, move everything upstairs. I don't wanna sort of have bits and pieces everywhere. But these are beautifully glittered um, foiled washi tapes. Um, I don't know if you're gonna see how pretty they are on camera. Um, but they're stunning. I do believe if you go to Marshmallow Studios Instagram and again their store and website will be like well their website will be linked below um, You'll be able to find them on Instagram and This this washi is their nebula rose washi. So it is very glittery um, And it's got like the silver foil throughout again. I don't know if you can see that on Camera, but like guys look how much washi is on this roll. That's insane. Um, but when I saw it, I had to have it because I've got the Nebula Rose sticker album and I needed to add it. Um, and then these three are more, they're kind of, so this, they're, they're kind of ombre, particularly this one here. So it goes from like a pink to like a purpley, bluey color. And it's got some silver foil in there, some beautiful little stars, and it's got like a glittery sheen. And again, look how much washi is actually on that roll. Um, and then the other two are much the same, just we've got one in like a dusty pink that sort of goes into like a blue color. And then you've got just a purple, purple pink kind of ombre. They're absolutely stunning. Um, so I had to have those. And after discovering Debbie Downer last year, I had to top up my collection. So this is just a little thank you card to protect my little Debbie Downer. And it just says, thank you, Melissa, Marshmallow Studio, and this hedgehog Guys, it is so cute. And then it just has all their social media. So again, guys, you can see it here. Um, so you, it's marshmallowstudio.com.au. Um, follow and tag them at underscore marshmallowstudio underscore. Join their Facebook group. Find them on Etsy. Um, so I had to add to my Debbie Downer kit, or collection rather. Got some little freebies here. So these are some hand-drawn string bows. Very cute. You've then got a little happy 2019 freebie. You've got Shannon Kev there. Thank you for your order. Some little love hearts and stars, some little wine glasses, bouquet of flowers, a little bow, a present, some sunnies and like a post truck. And yes, guys, all of these are stickers. So you can use all of them and then I just like I said got some more of my Debbie Downer so I've got rainy day or bad day rather Debbie Downer so she's just standing there with her eyes closed under a rain cloud I got the <laughs> no happy mail stickers this I <laughs> I felt this way like most of my orders have come in within the last week and prior to that like between Christmas and New Year knowing that I had orders on the way and checking my post box every day this is exactly how I felt. So I figured I'm gonna get one of these. No happy mail. She's basically kicking and breaking the mailbox um, because there's no happy mail. I then got the sneaky day off. Um, so this is pretty much me on a day off. I generally sit on the couch, sometimes with popcorn, sometimes not, and I binge watch Netflix and or YouTube. So she's perfect. The last one, can't keep my eyes open. This is very much me at the moment. I'm so tired and even as I'm sitting here filming this, I have the biggest migraine, but I'm so far behind on filming and playing with me's and all of that that I needed to catch up for you guys. Um, but yeah, super cute. So very small, basic order from Marshmallow Studio, but again, one of my favorite Australian stores. Links will be in the comments below. And if you want to check them out, I definitely encourage you to do so. Okay, my next order is from Sweet Lilac Designs. Again, another amazing Australian store. This is, I think I've ordered from her a couple of times now. Um, and again, I just needed to pick up some of these kits. Like I needed to, because again, like I said to you guys, I don't want to be in a situation where I was a little while back where I was purchasing stickers after the fact and then getting lazy and not wanting to plan because I was already behind and no, we're not doing that this year. So I am pre-planning and I started sourcing Valentine's Day kits um, and I saw some others that I wanted to get and it was a sale, at the time. I can't remember what the sale was, it was like 15% off or something like that. I thought, you know what, 
Let's take advantage of it. It's another Australian um, store. Let's support Australian small business. Um, so I did. Um, so as per usual, you just get like a little business card um, with all of the social media platforms on it. Just purple on the back. I got a little thank you 2019 freebie with just some quarter boxes, um, some alcohol, some flowers and a 2019 sticker. I then, I haven't figured out what I'm going to use these for and I actually have these in the pink foil as well, but how stunning are they? They're like the, um, the foil, it's beautiful. So I've got these in red and pink, I don't know what I'm going to use them for yet. But I wanted to get a hold of these guys again if you have any idea what I can use these for comment below into the kits so like I said I picked up a couple of kits I'm just gonna separate them into kit because otherwise I'll end up spoiling it amidst another one so I picked up three kits from Sweet Lilac um, like I said all in the all in the spirit of pre-planning and getting my shit together this year so the first one I picked up, actually I'll do it in order. The first one I picked up is my one of, I've got two Australia Day kits to pick from. I don't know which one I'm gonna use yet, but this is one of them. When I saw it on the website, I kind of ummed and eyed a bit. I wasn't sure if I wanted to stay traditional or whether I wanted to maybe get something in like a green and yellow color scheme. Um, when I saw this, I thought, you know what? It's on sale. I know that the Sweet Lilac Designs, the, the matte quality, like the quality of her sticker paper is gorgeous. Um, it's really soft and buttery and smooth. Um, and I thought, you know what? It's on sale. Let's get it. Very Australian. Forget what his, uh, what is his name? Don't know what he's called in the movie. I forget. It's been so long since I've seen it, but we've got little Mr. Little uh, Crocodile Dundee over here. Our quote box with a, an Australian beach saying, keep calm and love Australia. The good old cork hat, some cricket stumps, a cricket bat and a cricket ball. My husband wants me to use this one for Australia Day. He's actually out playing cricket as we speak. It is 38 degrees today, guys. And he's out in long pants, standing in the sun, catching a ball and swinging a bat. I vote, you know what, let's have a vote. If you think that is absolutely insane and that cricket is the most boring sport ever, leave a comment below in the section, write cricket sucks. If you're with me, cricket sucks is the comment to leave below. Um, don't get me wrong, when he played his grand final, they got into the grand final last year and they won. Yay. I went and watched, but I'm sorry. Back in the early days when we first started dating, I went and watched him one day. I sat in the heat for like six hours and I haven't done it again since till last year when they made the grand final. Um, but otherwise, I'm not watching it on TV. It's too boring. Um, we've got the Opera House. We have a cute little koala, our, our flag specifically focusing on the Southern Cross and a cute little indigenous man here. Um, then we've got our full boxes, very bright, very happy our half boxes, our quarter boxes, and some scalloped, quarter, scalloped, quarter boxes. You've then got your today's to do's, little things, um, individual hydration trackers, and you know, your little bits and pieces, labels. That's what I call them anyway. You've got some habit trackers, your weekly, uh, what are they called? What are these called? Week weekly habit list, weekly habit tracker, whatever. Your weekend banners, some functional items, bill juice sticker, date night, coffee time, many, many stickers here to use. You've got your bottom washi, which is the ever famous Harbour Bridge, some washi strips. Then of course, you've got your deco, your date dots and your date covers. And we are back to the beginning. So I thought that was super cute. So I'm, I'm actually now more leaning towards using that kit. Um, I then got a more neutral kit, as in like it's an anytime kit, you can use it any time of the year, and I feel like the quote box resonates with probably most, if not everyone. Mondays should be optional, or Monday should be optional rather. Um, and it's just some cute little panda deco. So you've got a cute little panda who's slouched down with a face mask on, cute little panda with a hat, 
Uh, the, oh, wow. Okay, I'm not going to zoom into that. I was actually about to read that, but for anyone who has this kit and anyone who doesn't, please go onto this website, Sweet Lilac Designs, just to check out this full box. So in the little cup there, it says, I hate mornings, and the little face mask says something else, which is a little bit more expletive. I'm not going to repeat it in case there are children watching, but absolutely love this kit. This is going to be like probably my favorite kit now. Um, we've got some little pandas climbing some bamboo shoots, some bamboo related decor. Um, very, very cute. And the color scheme is beautiful. It's like mint. Um, there's like some gold details in it and uh, pastel pink. You've got your full boxes. Again, with your half boxes, quarter boxes and scalloped quarter boxes, your todays, your to do's, your little things. And of course your hydration stickers. Your weekly habit trackers, icons, weekend banners, habit trackers, build you stickers, and your, is that? Okay, so I'm not there yet. And then you've got, of course, your bottom washi, your washi strips, or decorative washi, whatever you wanna call that. And then, of course, some cute little pandas, again, with the I hate mornings, the expletives, <laughs> the date dots and the date covers. Casey Ann, I love you. This kit, this kit is me. This, this panda? This is my spirit animal, okay? I am embracing the face mask expletive panda for this year. <laughs> he is my, I, I definitely channel him slash her on my, every time Monday rolls around. Absolutely stunning. Cannot wait to use that kit. And the last thing that I got from Sweet Lilac Designs this time around is a more Valentine's themed kit. Again, you don't have to restrict it to Valentine's. I do feel like it's a, a kit that you can sort of use anytime. Like it's for, yeah, again, Valentine's kit. It can be for people who are anti-Valentine's as in like celebrating, because the quote box says, I love me. So it can be an anti-Valentine's kit. It can be an anniversary kit. It can be a holiday kit. It can be, you know, someone, you, you know, you live by yourself and you've got a week to yourself at home because your flatmates are out of the house, whatever it might be, you can use this pretty much any time. So you've got a Coco Paris perfume bottle. I had to have it just for these. Now, I have a French Bulldog. He is not this color. Originally, when we were looking for a French Bulldog, this is the color I wanted, the cream variation. Um, couldn't find one. Um, and when I found the picture of my little guy, um, buddy, he also has an Instagram, which I will link below for you guys in case anyone is interested. Yes, I am that person. I have an Instagram account for my dog. It's not up to date. I haven't posted anything on there in a while, but yes, he does have one. Um, so when we, when I saw the photo of Buddy, he was too cute. I had to have him, but I wanted it because it had the French Bulldogs in it. That's literally why I bought this kit. You've got a little fashion girl with a coffee cup in a little dressing robe, some little florals. You've got some toast with a little love heart shaped egg. Um, and then just obviously some decorative full boxes there. You've got your full boxes in a very sort of loved up February Valentine's color palette. Full boxes, quarter boxes, scallop boxes. Today is to do's little things hydration trackers, weekly habit trackers, weekend banners, functional icons, bill dues, and so on. You've got your functional washi strips, decorative washi strips, your bottom washi strips, and of course you have your deco. So you've just got some cute little like love perfume bottles, um, like a breakfast tray, your date dots, and your date covers. Um, so again, another Australian store, guys. If you are looking for Australian stores to buy kits from, Please check out these stores that I mentioned today. They are fabulous. Um, sticker quality is amazing. I am a repeat buyer from a lot of these stores. I only, actually I don't think, I think the only order that I have that was a first order from a store I've not tried before was my Sweet Lilac, um, not Sweet Lilac, my Arctic Paper, Paper Studio order. So I, I'm pretty sure that every other store that I'm hauling today, I purchased from before. So that kind of just tells you that it's worth going back again. My next order is from the ever lovely Stellaboo Sticker Co. Again, I must have bought 800,000 things from them by now. Um, so again, this one, 
is probably the biggest order I have placed in a while. I bought so many things. Um, she, I think it was a sale, so she had a sale on. Let's ignore my address. She had a sale on. I think this was Boxing Day sales. So she had a sale, and then yeah, it was just that was that was it. But because she had Afterpay and it was a sale, and like I said, I wanted to buy spoiled things. I uh, went hard and didn't go home. Um, okay, so we've got a cute little freebie and it just says time to plan. Yay, it's payday, grocery shop, me time, order stickers, doctor's appointment and date night. And that's just like on a matte paper. Like I said, guys, I went hard on the foil this year or will be going hard on the foil this year. So I've just got a little business card um, again all of the socials, socials, well, website will be linked below. Mixed metals here, guys, so I'm just gonna flick through a lot of these very quickly. So I've got some upload stickers. They're not in order, so I apologize. I'm gonna try and move through things fairly quickly. Um, I've got some Disney overlays. Again, I got these in multiple foils because I want to use or try to incorporate these in my rewind spreads because we went to Disneyland and Disney World. Um, and I'm not sure what kits I'm using yet. So I kind of got a couple different ones so that no matter what kit I use or what foil it has or doesn't have, I can use either or. Got some um, header overlays, some silver bows. We've got some full box overlays. These are like a dotted kind of full box overlay. Some more of the confetti headers, silver. Some full boxes, so that's like a confetti sparkle kind of thing. Wanted to try something different again, hoping to incorporate this for Valentine's Day. Um, but it's like a floral silver, which I thought was really cute. We have some silver full box overlays. There's a little bit of a scratch out of that one. Um, silver full box overlays. Some corner full box overlays, some of the gold dotted overlays, we've got the gold bow overlays, another, so this is in the hollow gold which is probably again my favourite. I got some date dots in gold, I got some hallow months in silver foil, so hallow January through to hallow December. Some public holiday stickers, so Happy New Year, Australia Day, Valentine's Day. This is basically all of the main Australian, uh, Australia, Australian public holiday stickers or holiday stickers. I got some Valentine's full box overlay quote boxes. So this one says, it was always you. Our love story begins here. Love you more than yesterday. Every love story is beautiful, but ours is my favorite. I love those. I have the holidays in gold, the hallow months and seasons in gold, some foiled confetti flag overlays, also in the silver and also in the rose gold. I've got payday again in the mixed metal, so I've got gold. I have rose gold and I have silver. I then have edit in mixed foils, so gold, silver. Back to the upload stickers, which I also got in the gold. Edit in rose gold. I got some small, I think this is her small doodles or, <laughs> sorry guys, um, the small doodles or the small icons stickers and I got them in the mixed metals. So you've got your gold, you've got like everything, like you've got Instagram, you've got trolleys, TVs, appointments, balloons, trash, face masks, like everything. Silver and of course rose gold. And then again, back to some double ups. So I've got the love story quote boxes in silver, 
the corner overlay full boxes in silver and the upload stickers in silver. So that's all the foil items that I've got. I then picked up two kits. I'm pretty sure the last kit was a freebie that she chucked in, but I will check that in a minute. Um, so this kit that I got here, I eyed it off for a little while. Again, it was heavily reduced. It was like down to like 40% clearance. And I was like, you know what? I need to pick it up. Either I'm gonna use it, it's gonna be my preferred birthday kit, or I'm gonna use it for someone else's birthday, or I'm gonna hoard it for something. So this is the kit. Now it's a vertical kit, so I'm kind of just, so it's in the hollow gold foil, which is my favorite, as I said, guys, part of why I picked it up. And it's all like birthday themed. So you've got a cute little unicorn, you've got some macarons, you got a birthday cake or birthday tower, a gift, you've got a unicorn, like a um, unicorn horn, you've got a crown with a little combo sneaker, then you've got a little cupcake, a unicorn, some balloons, um, and then some washi. So I love the color scheme and I love the gold foil. So I'm hoping, yeah, this might show you better. I'm hoping to use this for my birthday kit this year. Um, so that's your full boxes. You've then got, um, I think this might be in her old format. I think she's reformatted. So this is all changed, but these are just like your today's, your to-do's, your littles. You have your full boxes, quarter boxes, bill juice stickers, um, and work stickers. Your heart checklist, which there is many, many, many of. You have your bottom washi, which is very, very foiled. And your date covers. And again, this is what, when I was saying to you guys that I wanted to get some of the neutral, um, items from like Arctic Studio and, and Arctic Paper Studio. This is why, because this kit is obviously focused heavily on foil and by bringing in more foil, I feel like it will just be overdone. It will like kill the kit. So I got some neutral stuff as well. Page flags, date dots. Um, you've got functional items here. So like pay bills, doctor's appointments, happy mail, girls nights, things like that. Your weekend banner. New releases, movie marquee, a little laptop there. You can use it for like binging YouTube or if you use, if you upload to YouTube, you can use it for that. You've got some heart checklists. <coughs> and then your glitter headers and appointment labels. Again, with that gorgeous hollow gold foil. Guys, I feel like I've been talking too much. I am losing my voice and I still have so much more to go. So again, if you're still watching, you're still with me right now. Thank you. Give me a thumbs up to show me that you're still here. Better yet, hashtag still here in the comments below. Um, unfortunately with haul videos, you can't really speed them up too much because you're kind of talking and talking through what shops and stuff you bought things from. But again, you can always skip through. If there's shops that I mentioned that you like, you can go back and forth. You can fast forward through stores you may not like or wish to purchase from. Um, so that's up to you guys. Um, so this is the other kit that I got that I was gonna, or I'm contemplating using for Australia Day. So for anyone who's followed me for a little while, anyone who follows me on Instagram, you would have seen that for Christmas last year, one of the kits that I used was her Summer Santa kit. Um, it was beautiful. The way that it turned out, I loved it so much. And when I saw this, I was like, you know what, that's perfect. Like it's basically the same set out, except it's not Santa, it's Australian animals. Um, and again, it like foiled detail on that. So, got a little kangaroo, echidna, hill neck lizard, got a kookaburra. I think that might be a kiwi. You've got koala, you've got a little fox. So, mm, so okay, so some of these are native Australian, some aren't. You've got a croc, you've got a platypus, and you have the ever famous emu. You've then got again your today's, your to-dos, your littles, and your little icon bits and pieces, your half boxes, your quarter boxes, your work labels, your build juice stickers, your heart checklists and habit trackers, 
page flags, date dots, functional items, and heart checklists for those of you who white space plan. I never use these. Your bottom washi, again, just another playoff on the previous. So you've got a, a crocodile, you've got your echidna, you've got a platypus, you've got a kangaroo over here, or just playing on the beach. Very, very cute, very Australian to me. Um, and then I don't know why, but apparently I ordered these separately. So I have two of these, but it's just your glitter headers and your appointment labels. Now, like I said to you guys, I'm pretty sure this, I, I don't remember ordering this kit, but it was chucked in to my order. Thank you so much, Brianna. I really, really appreciate it. It's another gorgeous <coughs> foiled kit. So this is very much an anytime kit. So you've got Love Grows Here, Love Sweet XOXO, got a Love with two little fashion girls, Snuggle Up, some books, um, some Snuggle Weather. So very much an anytime kit. Now this is in the, this must be the new format. It is. So you'll see that this varies from the previous. So here is your glitter headers and your appointment labels and you've got two options for your weekend banner in the new, the new format. Um, you've got like meals this week, next week, work important and don't forget. You've then still got your half boxes, quarter boxes, bill dues and work stickers. Your heart checklists and habit trackers. Yeah, so it's the new, new layout. Okay, then you've got some more functional items. So you've got some little like hand-drawn doodle type style items. You've got the ones that were on the previous. So just your more um, decorative kind of fun appointment, not appointment, functional stickers, your heart checklists, you've got your page flags. Um, these you could use, I guess, for anything really. Um, and then you have your bottom washi. So very, very cute with the, like the lavender purple, the silver foil and the plaid. Very, very cute. Thank you again, Brianna. I really, really appreciate it. Again, guys, her store link, if you don't have it already, will be in the comments below. I'm running out of room to store the items I've already hauled, guys. Like if I, if things avalanche down on us, I apologize. Just having a sip of coffee because my throat is and my lips are really dry. I have been talking for 56 minutes. My goodness. All right, next order. So this Old Faithful. This is from Scribble Prints Co. So Scribble Prints Co, I've actually combined two orders here. I have been ordering a few of the Wiggle Wednesdays. For any of you that don't know what Wiggle Wednesday is, you need to check it out. I have not purchased from Scribble Prints Co for a long time um, until she started Wiggle Wednesday. And I started with one and then I bought another and then another. There are a few that I have missed or didn't really like or didn't see myself using, so I, I didn't buy those. But definitely urge you guys to check it out. Um, because of the shipping costs from from America to Australia, when I buy from Scribble Prints Co, I kind of want to make it worth it. So rather than just paying, I think it's like $10 for Wiggle Wednesday, I'm like, you know what, $10, $20 shipping or $15 shipping, whatever it is, I can't justify that. So when I do a Wiggle Wednesday, if there are any kits there or any foil items there that I want, I buy them. That way I can kind of justify the pricing. I know it means spending more money, but that way I kind of feel like the pricing for shipping is a little bit better. So there's two orders here. So there's one that I ordered before Christmas and have been sitting on for a little while. And then there's one that I ordered just after Christmas. So we'll go to the before Christmas items first. So actually, you know what? I'll start with the Wiggle Wednesday because this is the first Wiggle Wednesday that I ever purchased. This is what made me start ordering from Scribble Prints Co again. And I was obsessed with the colour. I don't know how I'm going to use it yet or if I'm going to use it or whether I just want to hold on to it because it's amazing. But we'll get to that. So quite a few things here. Just That's just my order. Yep, okay. All right. So firstly, we get cute little freebie. So it says, you go hot cocoa. And then buy more Scribble Prints Co. So again, you can use this like as an overlay for any kit or quote box or um, and then you buy a scribble prints co you can put in like a monthly layout you can put it in 
your weekly spread, whatever you might like. Comes with a gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous journaling card with a pretty silver bow. Wiggle Wednesday, come at me. Okay. What is that? Did I buy three Wiggle Wednesdays? Okay, I'm confused. Whatever. So, the first Wiggle Wednesday, and I'm hoping I have all of the bits and pieces. So, you can buy each of the Wiggle Wednesday items separately, or you can buy them as the package, and I think you save a couple of dollars, and you'll also get a freebie. So, this is the first Wiggle Wednesday I ever purchased, and I'm hoping that it's going to be picked up for you on camera, because it's stunning. So, this is the freebie that you get if you buy all of the sheets. So, it's just a me time, new releases, coffee run, plan next week, payday, and happy mail sticker. I'm hoping you can see that. It's like a gorgeous, like, teal blue kind of, like, it's stunning. You then have your little icon sheets. Self-explanatory, really. But I just really want you guys to get, like, how pretty that foil is. You've got your, like, corner overlays. So, again, I'm just going to turn it sideways. We have some functional items. Oh, it's my little calendar scratched off a bit. Um, but again, like, how pretty are they? And then you get into your full box overlays. So this is just the, the confetti. Confetti. Header overlays. You've got the full boxes. And of course, you've got the option of two different bottom washi overlays. So you've got your love hearts and your bows. Again, all in that gorgeous color. Now, like I said, I went looking for Wiggle Wednesdays and I purchased more than Wiggle Wednesdays. So, justifying the price for myself, I've also gone in and bought a kit. So with this particular Wiggle Wednesday, I was like, you know what? I am obsessed with this show. I'm waiting for the new episodes to come out. When the new episodes come out, I am using this kit and I may even use those Wiggle Wednesdays with it. I feel like they might go with it kind of. Um, but we got, and welcome, Jane the Virgin. I am obsessed with this show. Does anyone else watch it? Are you team Michael or are you team Raphael? I. Much like Twilight, I go back and forth between the two. So I was originally Raph, then I went to Michael, then I went to Raph, then to Michael, then to Raph. Currently with Raph pending new episodes, we will see what happens. But yes, introducing Jane the Virgin. If you haven't checked it out, guys, I definitely recommend you check it out. It's on Netflix now, and I think there's currently three, maybe four seasons that are there to stream. Um, so I picked this up. Very, very cute. You've got Jane, you've got Michael, you've got Raph, you have, um, oh my God, Mateo. Um, again, that won't mean anything to those of you who do not watch the show. You've got the Marbella, you've got the flower, pregnancy test, and a little laptop and some little message, messenger icons. Again, probably means nothing to you unless you watch the show, but very, very relevant to the series. Then got some little deco. You've got your work labels, some little scribblers, lols, <laughs> that's cute. Um, movie icons, just some random bits and pieces. You have, oh my gosh, that is so cool. You, this little sticker here, so this one says, Jane the Virgin season finale, and this one says binge watch Jane the Virgin. So you can literally put that as a sticker in your spread. Yes. Wow, like, that is so cool. Andrea, you are the best. That, yep, best ever. Um, okay, we've got functional items. We have a different style of functional items. This must be in the newer format. Like I said, I've not purchased from Scribble Prints Co. for a very long time. So this is all very new to the last kit that I purchased from her. Page flags, habit trackers, more functional items, your weekly trackers your half boxes, quarter boxes, appointment labels, reading labels, bill due stickers. 
You've got your washi strips, some fancy labels, your to-dos, today's little things, and this color scheme is very, very much in sync with the full boxes. I love it. Very different. I feel like it's something that you don't see sort of everywhere either. It's like a, like a, I wouldn't say blush. It's kind of like a salmony pink type color with like a mint green. Very pretty. Um, you've got your like littles, some more fancy labels, some more washi strips, your checklists, your date covers, your bottom washi. Now with the bottom washi, the way that um, Andrea, Andrea, I'm always confused with that name because I feel like we pronounce things differently to America and vice versa. So anyway, um, the way that these are done now is you can use the washi that comes with the kit or you can actually substitute in an alternate option. So I got the alternate option because I wasn't sure how I wanted to do it. So you could either like use these two, you could use these two, whatever you wanted to do, you basically then have the option to change it up. So I got both of those. I then of course purchased the glitter headers, the fancy labels, glitter page flags and glitter quarter boxes. And then I, on top of that kit, which I absolutely love and cannot wait to use, so thank you so much Scribble Prints Co. I also purchased another couple of things. So I got some cute little laptop labels, labels, I'm losing my mind. Um, some cute little laptops with some little bows on there. Um, so this, again, you can use this for anything. It can be for work, it can be for blogging, it can be for um, editing videos, uploading videos, binge watching YouTube on your laptop, it, anything, super functional. So I picked up some of those, I thought they were really cute. I also picked up some coffee cups, similar thing, they've got their little bows on them um, and just a range of different colors. I'm a coffee addict as we speak. I have my little coffee cup to the side here. Coffee is life, guys, like I said before. I'm gonna get a lot of use out of those. And then I just picked up some random glitter headers in some different colors. Um, you can never have too many glitter um, headers in my opinion. So I just picked up two of the, two of these. Um, so you've just got like a burgundy color, you've got like a fuchsia magenta color, like a purpley lilac-y type color, pastel pink. You've got like a more of a kind of candy pink, a plum, like a violet or an indigo type color. You've got like an ocean blue. You've got like a sky blue an emerald green, black, um, like a gray kind of silver. You've got like a bluey silver, another sort of version of the bluey silver. You've got like a yellowy gold and then like a really, really dusty pink color. So that was the first order that I got from Scribble Prints Co. Now, like I said, I'm a little bit confused because I don't actually remember ordering one of the parts of this, but it looks as though I also picked up there's two lots of wash, um, Wiggle Wednesdays in here. So I also got what looks to be the hollow. I do, actually, I do remember getting the hollow because I was obsessed with it and I got it. Idiot me, it was the first time. I didn't realize that Scribble Prints Co., when they released their cyber mystery kits, the glitter packs and things like that, the washi packs go with that. So I had purchased the washi, which I don't have with me and I apologize, but I can show you later if you guys want or I'll do it for a washi Wednesday or something like that. I picked up the glitter pack <laughs> and the foil pack, but I didn't, sorry, picked up the washi pack and the foil pack, but I didn't pick up the kit because it was sold out and I didn't realize that they kind of went hand in hand. But it doesn't matter, like I said, Holo is my favorite glitter. I'm oh, sorry, my favorite foil. So I picked it up anyway. Um, everything's kind of doubled up here. Hang on, let me just sort this out. I've made a bit of a mess here. Yeah. So I think I just picked up some random glitters, as, uh, some random foils as well. That's probably why. Okay, so basically, as I didn't do this very well, but basically, guys, I've picked up the Hollow Wiggle Wednesday. So it was basically everything I showed you guys before. Um, oh, hang on. Nope, nope. I did pick up the Hollow. I don't know where it is. This is actually $75 plus freebie. So because I spent $75 with Scribble Prints Co, I got a freebie in the hollow foil. And it basically just has some glitter headers, some functional items, your plan next week, payday, happy mail, me time, new releases, coffee run, and a full box overlay. So that's what that is, that makes sense. But then I do have, 
I don't know if these were Wiggle Wednesdays or if I've just picked up, this is how long it's been since, like, that I've been waiting out doing this haul. Like, I've literally got stuff everywhere. So I don't know whether they were Wiggle Wednesdays, but I basically, I have a bunch of overlays. So I've got like the rose gold overlays, full box ones. I've bought two of each. So I'm assuming I've just picked them up because I wanted full box overlays. Again, with the whole idea of moving into the foils in into, um, 2019. I've then got, yes, yeah, see, so I've got two of the gold as well. So I'm assuming I've just picked them up. To, again, I've probably ordered a Wiggle Wednesday and I've picked these up as a way of building my foil collection but also making the shipping worthwhile. So I've picked up some foil items. So the rose gold, the gold, then I've got the silver here as well, the full boxes. Very, very cute. Very, very minimalistic, which I, I really like. And then I've gotten the same again. So for each of those, I've gotten the corresponding, corresponding, oh my God, guys, I need a break already. And I wanted to film three videos for you today. Let's see if that happens. Um, I've got the corresponding um, confetti headers. So, so gold, silver, rose gold. And then I think I've done the same. Yeah, okay. So I've done the same. I've gotten the love heart bottom washi overlays in the rose gold, the gold, and the silver. I've then gotten the same again, but in the star option. So I've got all three overlays there in the starry option. So very practical, you can use them for Christmas, you can use them for any time really. And then of course I got the icons in each of the medals as well. That makes sense. So much confusion, confusion for something that wasn't actually that complicated. All right. Now, again, so this is my, so this would have been my third because like I said, I did pick up three Wiggle Wednesdays. I picked up the blue. I picked up the hollow, which I don't know where that is at the moment. Cause again, like I said, my planner stuff is all over the place, which is why I'm working on setting up upstairs. So everything can stay together. Um, so that's somewhere, but the third Wiggle Wednesday that I picked up is this one here and it is stunning and I'm not going to spoil it just yet. So another journaling card, another gorgeous silver scribble prints co bow, my order, we got a little freebie again. So this one says happy new year and of course buy more scribble prints co. And let's get straight into the Wiggle Wednesday. This is my personal favorite. I think I, yeah, I did. So I actually picked up two of these. One, because I wanted to hoard it and look at it forever because it is stunning. And one, because I actually wanted to use it. It is incredible. And guys, I'm sorry if you missed out on this because it is gorgeous. So again, I always get all of the items so that I get the freebie. So you've just got your little bows again, your me time, new releases, coffee run, plan next week, payday and happy mail. Now I don't know, I think my daylight is leaving me. So let me open the window. Let's see if this works a little bit better. Does that, oh, I need to, oh, there we go. Look at that color. It is like, it's like magenta or hot pink. It's stunning. I've got my little icons. So again, I'm hoping that that's picking up on camera. This is why I want to move upstairs as well, because where I'm sitting at the moment, I've changed locations twice. So I'm currently sitting in my dining room and I'm near a window, but when the sun starts moving up and over the house, I lose the sunlight. So I apologize if this isn't picking up, but honestly, the camera doesn't do it justice anyway. Like you need to see this in person. So you've got your icons there. Like I said, I've got double, so I'm just gonna move them to the side as I show you. You've got your little corner full box overlays. Stunning. Your confetti head. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna use it. Like I'm gonna, I have to find the perfect Valentine's Day kit and I have to use all of this foil on there. You've got your full box overlay. Done that. Wait, why do I have so many? Did I get... 
Okay, so I'm done. That's why. Okay. Done that. Done that. Done that. Done the freebie. Okay. And then the washi. Oh, like I, I can't get over it, guys. So pretty. So for that Wiggle Wednesday, again, I wanted to make it worthwhile getting the shipping to Australia, even though it's better on her actual shop, is, I think it's Shopify or standalone site, as opposed to Etsy. It's still expensive. Um, so again, I wanted to make it worth it. So I picked up another kit, and again, this is gonna go straight into my sticker album to be hoarded for next year. And it is this beautiful, beautiful Christmas kit. Now again, it is very wintry. It is very white Christmas, but you know what? I don't care. I'm always dreaming of a white Christmas. So you know what? I want this kit. I have seen so many gorgeous layouts of this, like the way that this has been used in people's spreads and I just had to have it. So again, Wiggle Wednesday, this is the kit that I picked up for that order. So you've got some beautiful full boxes there. And it's like a, like I said, very white Christmas. It's like accented with like pearl white, um, like a beautiful metallic dusty pink. You've got your weekend banner, your work labels, your page flags, your deco. Um, the quote says, it's the most wonderful time of the year, which it is. Christmas is my favorite time of year, if you haven't heard that from me a million times already. Your functional items, some half boxes and more functional items with like the background on them. You've got your more page flyers, your weekly habit trackers, habit trackers, functional items, and the, the checklists. You have your quarter boxes, full boxes, bill dues, reading labels, and appointment labels. You have your decorative washies, fancy labels, your headers, so like today's to do little things, your more functional items and fancy labels, your heart checklists, the full boxes, and of course the washi along with the date covers. So that was my few orders apparently from Google Books Co. We're getting to the very back of things now, guys. So I don't think. Yeah, I'm not going to do that one because that was actually from a D stash. And D stashes aren't very frequent for me, so I kind of just D stash like whatever I feel like it. Um, okay, so this is from another Australian store. When I first saw the envelope, I was like, what the heck is this? What, what order have I not received? And then I opened it. And the minute I opened it, I was like, mm hmm, I know who that is. It is Fox and Cactus. So the first couple of things I got. Again, it wasn't a sale. I think it was just like a restock. It's like, these are her like oopses or like seconds quality or whatever you want to call it. So I picked up some washi tape. Okay, so I got Mr. Nightmare Before Christmas himself. And it's got like, um, it's like the colors are really cute. So again, either for Halloween or to be used for my secret upcoming projects um, but that was really cute I got like a galaxy kind of moon silver foil it's like a dark plum purple color and really really cute and I got this very Beetlejuice inspired washi tape so I'm hoping to get a Beetlejuice kit for Halloween this year and to incorporate this washi with it into the actual order itself. Didn't get too much. Um, I've got so much Fox and Cactus in one of my albums already. So I didn't want to overload. I didn't have to top up on anything yet, but I wanted to add some stuff to my collection and I wanted some of the newer releases. So I picked up just a few things. So of course, traditionally, Fox and Cactus, you get your cute little journaling card or postcard, very leaning into February, those cute little, I don't know what they're called, what are they called? The little lollies with hearts on them and they have like love messages on them. That's what these are here, but this one is all very cat focused. So you've got cat hair, don't care, meow, I love cats. Very cute. You then have your January freebie. So you've got like a little spyro dragon, you've got a little pot plant, the Fox and Cactus um, logo. A little Hulk woman uh, with pastel purple hair and a switch off kind of three quarter box going on there. And then, I, like I said, I just picked up a couple of things. Some of what I wanted did sell out, but 
keep an eye out and if and when it's restocked I will buy them again had to pick up the hot cross buns we are our Easter tradition Good Friday every year without fail hot cross buns for breakfast smothered in butter cannot wait had to have these for my planner so hot cross buns there were two variations of this I did miss out on one but like I said I still wanted to pick this one up so it is cute little Eeyore and he's under a rainy cloud so the other one was like a mood variation but these are super cute again don't know if I actually want to use them or whether I just want to hoard them because they are gorgeous I got famous internet personality the angry cat or the grumpy cat rather um, so perfect to mark those moody days perfect to mark days when you just don't feel like doing anything he's just super cute I got some little what I'm going to call head wigs um, or um, happy mail owls so you've, got, you've just got like the little owl delivering the envelope you've got him on a mailbox you've got him flying um, so I thought that was cute I don't know the names of these guys and I do apologize but I got this little she's like a little coffee girl so she's got like in one she's got like what looks like like a iced coffee or, or frappuccino coffee cup with a scarf on and just obviously the different variations of that some Disney girls again to rewind with little pink and red bow variations I got some workout girls because guys I need to get in shape I say it every year that I need to lose weight but doctor's orders this year again don't want to go too much into it just yet but doctor's orders are I need to get fit and healthy and I need to lose some weight so I thought I would get some little fox and cactus girls to help me mark that out in my planner and make it look cute and of course as we are experiencing currently as we experienced the other week with a heat wave and as I'm filming right now in 38 degrees perfect 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 little summer girls you've got one sweating up a storm in front of a fan at the beach sitting in front of the aircon in the pool with a martini glass um, really really cute so that was my order from Pops and Cactus this time around and last but not least for anyone who has gotten this package recently just by looking at this envelope you know exactly what this is. I have been waiting for it for so long. This mailer is absolutely stunning. And this is why I wanted to film my haul for you so badly because I want to use the contents and get my stuff sorted. So, let's pull this out. All right, for any of you serious planner girls, we all know we need a way to store our stickers. Lo and behold, planner face. So Anna had these, I've seen, I'd seen these on her Instagram for quite a while. She hadn't had any on sale. When she put the mini sticky kits up for sale, I have purchased two of hers to store like my little um, Fox and Cactus girls in and little icon stickers in. But I wanted to get my hands on the Jumbo album for my sticky kits. I've got so many sticker kits and I've got like, large deco um, items so like I've got a page of like lazy day chill relax stickers from planting roses and I just like I can't I had nowhere to store everything so I went hard and I actually got three of her album variations now I'm not going to go in and actually open them up because there's little bits and pieces in them that you guys have seen before in some of my other orders but I got her like galaxy swirl or galaxy style album so they're jumbo size so they're supposed to fit all your sticky kits um, which again just by doing like a let's for example grab my scribble prints co kit all right she's gonna fit perfectly in there perfect um, and just your sleeves so I think each of them store 60 60 stickers so I got the galaxy I got the gorgeous gorgeous flower one Vicky, you need this in your life. Um, so that's just another variation. And then I am denied about this one. I wasn't going to get it. I was just going to get two. And I was like, you know what? No, I'm getting three. If I don't use it now, I'll find a way to use it later. I'll use it for something else. So I got the marble swirl. And it's like a dusty pink into like a black and gray. Stunning. Um, I did lie, guys. I actually have one more item. Well, 
I'm gonna be really quick with these because everyone's already seen them and I feel like I'm last to the table. So I'm going to, I've got a couple of Simply Gilded things here. So first of all, I have a washi, washi order. Um, so cute little juniper here. Um, I did a washi order in between both subscription boxes and they arrived a little while ago. And like I said, I've been sort of sitting on them for a while. I don't wanna rip juniper, guys. Let me see. I really don't want to rip Jennifer, but I'm currently Jennifer Tricks. Sorry, Jennifer. Irene, don't put that cute little sticker there. I wanted to actually hoard that sticker, but now I can't because I just killed her. Ugh, I feel so bad. Look, what I did to her because I had to get it open. And I didn't have scissors here, so my bad. So I got a little journaling card. Now, it's kind of annoying because they bent it in transit. There's a little bend on their corner there. But cute little journaling card with a um, hollow dreamer juniper. And then I've just gotten a couple. I Again, I'm very, very new to this. I don't know the color variations, so forgive me. I think this is the Robin's Egg set. So I purchased the Robin's Egg set. It's like a teal, minty, greeny type bluey color with the silver bows. So I got those. I then got the blue and white polka dots with the silver bows, very wintry. It looks like it's a very wintry sort of washi tape. And then I got some of the smaller ones. So I've gotten the pastels with these. Um, so some have like hollow glitter and one has like gold and that's like a pastel pink, yellow, mint green and blue. Another like dusty pink color, like a lavender purple and like a bluey color. These all have the gold foil. And then I got the black and white variation as well. So I've got the black with the gold, the black with the silver, the white with the gold, and the white with the silver. Then I also picked up, because I'm planning on getting one of these planner trolleys, I don't know what they're called. I think I'm just gonna get one from Kmart and I'm even contemplating spraying it pink with spray paint. And I got a cute little magnet to stick on there. So it's just a glittery, like a holographic glitter um, like pale pink rose gold magnet and I think it's really really cute so I got that as well so that was my haul and then the next two things I have are of course the subscription boxes so I'm gonna go through them very quickly because I know that you've seen them everywhere else already but I only just enrolled so the November box was my very first box so I was super excited to, re to open it. And I haven't even looked at it. Like this is the first time I'm going to be looking at it. So I thought I'd share it with you guys too. Um, so that you can see everything. Um, and then that way I'm up to date until my next one comes. So hopefully my next one comes and I'll be able to do it, you know, in time with everyone else. So this is the November subscription box. Northern Comforts. So it comes with, so I'll do the washi first because I feel like that's what everyone wants to see first this pencil case oh my god it's like a little pouch so you could use it for like a pouch to carry like your, your important things your lady things your makeup um your washi your pens and pencils us planner girls you know never have too many pens and pencils and pencil cases am i right except this zipper doesn't want to open there we go i didn't want to break it so the most important part of any Simply Gilded subscription box is the washi, so I have learnt. So, this is all of the rolls for the Northern Comforts box. Again, I know you've all seen it again. Uh, you've seen it already, so I don't want to sort of spend too long on it, but you've got some cute little pattern washi. So this one has like a rose gold foil through it, and it just, it looks like, like sweater material. Like the, the pattern reminds me of like a sweater material. You've then got like a cute little grey, again, what reminds me of sweater material tape. 
very cute, very neutral, very wintry and or anytime washy. You have the deep blue with rose gold set. So you've got, of course, your thin washi with your thin bows and the thick variation. It's a really pretty color, actually. And I know of a kit that I'm gonna use this with 100%. Then you've got the ever so stunning Juniper. And again, she is on what reminds me of sweater type pattern washi with the little rose gold details. I'm not sure if you guys can see that from here. That's very, very cute. And then your like constellation type add-on. So this is the five millimeter add-on. You've got a white, the blue, and the pink, and all with the rose gold like constellation, like star type detail. And then of course you've got the world's cutest little bear. I don't know what I'm gonna do with him. I'm probably just gonna stash him away. I'll keep him on my desk once it's set up. He's really, really cute. Um, I'm not gonna open all of this plastic for you guys because again, you've already seen everything, but I'll just show you guys. So you've got a cute little keyring again with a little bear, little fish, and of course with the rose gold detailing. Very cute. You've got, oh, I didn't realize. So these are actually sticky notes. So you've got like a little hot cocoa. They're actually sticky notes. Those are so cute. Okay. You've then got some gorgeous little die cuts. So you've got like unicorns and bears. I'm not sure what else, like I said, I don't wanna open it and make a mess because I've literally got so much stuff in front of me now, guys, from this haul. Um, but some little die cuts. You then have, what is this? Cozy time. It's like a little book, of some sort. Again, I don't wanna open it, guys. I don't have scissors here, so it's gonna take me, an, an, like, it's gonna be a huge effort to open it. But a little book of some sort might be a notebook I'm not sure again it's my first box I've not really watched too many hauls in detail because I wanted to actually experience this for myself um, but you've got that there then you have a cute little journaling card which says in very good company and it's Juniper and her little yet to be named friend um, rose gold stars very very cute and then of course you've got the sticky kit as well so you've got again Juniper you've got your little bear your hot cocoa some little reminders, some full boxes. Very, very cute. Oh, and then, you know, your to-dos and your checklists, appointment labels, flags on the back. So that was the November box. Again, apologies for not actually opening it up. Again, I didn't want to bore you guys. This video has gone on a little while already and I don't want to sort of keep you guys around for too long, particularly when you've probably already watched this same unboxing 100 times. With that said, if you're on the opposite side, if you want me to actually, I was gonna do a separate video for these two unboxings, but again, because the unboxings are so old, like we're about to get the February box mailed out. So by the time that one comes, like it's gonna be too much. So rather than doing a haul on these, I just thought, rather than doing like an unboxing, I just thought I'll add it to my haul video. That way we're up to date and we're ready for the next one. But if you guys do want me to do individual unboxings of, um, Simply Gilded, let me know. I like, I'm happy to do it when they arrive. It's just that, like I said, these ones are behind. So I didn't want to essentially bore you guys. It's exciting for me, but whether you guys are excited by it, different story. So you've just got your little like checklist of what's in here. So you've got a foil journaling card, washi tapes, pocket tea and insert. That's what that was, okay. Polka dot pen, canvas pouch, paper clip set, foiled notepad, luxe sticker sheet and foiled adhesive pockets. So, here's your little polka dot pen. Very, very cute. Gold and like pearlescent white. Do I have anything to write on? No, I'm just gonna write on my hand here, guys. Oh, that writes really nicely. Okay. So you got your pen. As usual, you get a gorgeous, little pouch full of washi and this is really really cute it's got like a marble it's marbled but it kind of almost reminds me of like a pool like summer pool and like the pattern on top of the water so you've got that little pouch and then of course guys don't worry it's coming I'm stacking it as we speak 
Jeez, I, my hands aren't even big enough to hold it all. <laughs> we have the washi for this subscription box. So this was the royalty box and you can tell why. Look at the, like, ugh. I'm so in love with the, like I almost wish I got two of them because that foil, that gold, that, oh my gosh, it's beautiful. So you've got like a Dalmatian print tape with little roses on it and gold detailing. You have the five millimeter add-on, so all with gold foil. You've got the blue, the pink, like a tan brownie type color and the Dalmatian print. Very cute. You have like a little crown on like a bluey, like it's the same pattern or the same color as this. Very cute. You've got like this is stunning. Like I don't even want to open this. So it's like the reverse reverse washi. So it's the tape itself is gold, but the washi, the, the bows are like white or like transparent, whereas usually it would be the other way around. But these are gorgeous. And then you've got this little one here that says Queen, Royal Fun, Let Down, Let, let Down the Rabbit Hole. Oh, sorry, Let Something, and that's been cut off. Okay, then Down the Rabbit Hole. And you've got like a little teapot, a little crown, a cup and saucer, and some cake. Oh, and of course the juniper variation, all with that gold detail. Now we've also got the sticky notepads, which is very cute. Just saying royalty at the top with some gold detail, some pink and white polka dot. This is the the pocket inserts so you've got one that says queen with the pink and white polka dots and you've got the bunnies with a little like love heart and crown very cute i may have to give that one away though because i don't have a tn or am i going to get a tn who knows you've got a juniper key ring she's very very cute she's in like a foam or like a I don't know, she's very sturdy. And like a gold little chain, so you could add her to your planner. You can add her to, I don't know, your office, your keys, whatever you might like. Got some cute little paper clips. So you've got, again, like a crown, you've got juniper, and you've got a little teacup. So I'll turn it sideways just so you can see them a little bit better. And they're all in gold. Why do all of my packages come damaged? Stupid Australia Post. So the little end of this little teapot is like curled up. But you've got some little teapots in the color scheme and gold foiling you can use those for like again add them to your planner add them to your scrapbook add them to your mailers add them to orders that you're sealing off many many options you've got your tn insert which says down the rabbit hole on one side and just has a cute little bow on the front and again in that sort of pink and blue you've got what looks like is that like I don't know, it's not a peacock, or is it? I don't know, some like little woodlands creatures. You've got like a journaling card or a dashboard or whatever you might want to use this for. Again, just with the queen, the little bunnies and the crown and the heart. And last but not least, we have the sticker kit. So again, your today's, to-dos, remembers, checklists, appointments, page flags, your full boxes, YOLO. <laughs> let them eat cake. Um, so just some very, very cute gold detailed stickers there. But anyway, guys, I can't even, like I've got so much here, like I can't even put it back on the desk for you guys. There is so much here, like, you know what, no. You can just, <laughs> it's just my table and I. Um, that is it for today's haul. That is my very first haul, haul of January, um, 2019 rather, my very first haul for 2019 my January haul um, if you guys have not already please like and subscribe um, I have a few videos you guys can check out from last year if you have any questions pop them in the comments below um, I am hoping to stay very regular with these videos moving forward 
I hope you all had a wonderful, wonderful Christmas and New Year. Welcome 2019. It is going to be a great year. Um, Happy New Year, everyone, and bye for now.